Let's get to another question. DC's COVID-19 exposure notification system launched this week. It's called DC COVID Alert Notice or DC CAN. Virginia already has its own exposure notification system, COVID WAS. You're asking how do they work and what's the difference between the two? Okay, we're going to break it down for you. First off, can those two systems work together or are they completely incompatible? Here's what we heard from the Virginia Department of Health. At the moment, we have two separate servers where whether you're Virginia or whether you're DC. DC Health says DC can and COVID wise cannot yet exchange information to deliver alerts, but they expect that will change soon. And for those who commute between DC and Virginia, DC Health says you should use the tool for whichever place you spend the most time in. Next question. Why did DC launch a separate COVID-19 contact tracing tool in the first place? Without it, there is no way to do exposure notification for DC residents um, because disease reporting happens in a jurisdiction. Okay, so what are the concerns with having two different systems? Jeff says he doesn't foresee any issues and for residents of DC and Virginia, he says the biggest difference between the two tools is this. The district's tool is built into iPhone's operating system and Android users will have to download an app, whereas Virginia's COVID-wise is an app for all users. 